Hello guys and welcome back. Oh my god, you guys. So I just got home from my Tuesday workout. I actually didn't go work out last week, so at all. <laughs> like at all. And I'm beat. So I was going to bring my camera and show you guys a bit of footage. Sorry about my mess back there, by the way. I was gonna bring my camera, but I completely forgot. I was running late. I guess I just my body just is not used to waking up early anymore since I didn't wake up early um to go work out last week but yeah i think this is this was probably one of the hardest workouts ever because i took like a week break which i haven't done for like two months i feel like now so yeah i am beat i mean i feel better now obviously but yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and start this video because today I have a bunch of things to do. I'm actually going to film a video right now. I'm going to get my nails done. These are how my nails are looking right now. So not too crazy. Of course, spooky season is over. Well, I mean, it's Scorpio season, which is still spooky, but we're going for more fall themed nails this time around. If you guys would have seen last vlogs, last nail vlog, you guys know that I bought some nail decals that I want to use for this set. I think I'm going to go with something neutral. I'll show you guys more pictures once I head and get to the nail salon. But yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and start this video. I think I will insert a bit of this past weekend, which I didn't take many clips, but I did go to a museum with my friend. Um, and that was really cool. We actually ended up going to a museum in downtown LA. And then we just ended up grabbing something to eat at Sonora Town. And that was really good too. So yeah, I don't think I filmed too many clips or even really talked. So I'll go ahead and insert those right now. <laughs> this past weekend nothing too crazy i did not vlog anything else aside from that so i apologize but the time that i'm like filming this i still have to get up the past weekend's vlog so i think you guys should be good but yeah okay so just coming out here to make this little intro i was supposed to go grocery shopping today but i have my nail appointment at 10 a.m so i want to get some work done before that maybe i'll end up going grocery shopping tonight I kind of have to because I don't have I don't have groceries and I kind of wanted to wait until the beginning of November because I was a little over budget in October. <laughs> I don't know why I've been over budget in groceries. I mean, I'm still trying to adjust, of course, to living on my own. But it's hard, guys. It's really, really hard. I know some of you guys live on your own or pay for your own groceries. So if you do... Please let me know in the comments down below how much you guys budget or how much you spend on a monthly basis on groceries because I've been having some trouble with that. I'm not sure, but yeah, I don't look too cute right now. So I'm probably going to bring my hair down, make it into a braid. Yeah. Okay. I'll see you guys. Usually I would make my smoothie at this time, right? But I actually don't have any ingredients. The only thing I have is our bananas, but I think my milk 
is expired and my yogurt. So I'm probably just gonna have the protein waffles today for breakfast. All right, I'll see you guys in the next clip because I have to get some work done and I have to eat breakfast. Also, my sister came over yesterday. Well, my sister and Joel, I don't know which video will be going up because I filmed part of my day in the life. I think I'm gonna film the other half once I release new kits, but she ended up bringing me these cookies. They're so cute, they're like spooky cookies um, with little googly eyes. These are delicious. My sister is such a great baker. So I ate like, honestly, I ate like four last night. Super bad, but yeah. Oh, also, I want to mention this because today, um, my trainer Frankie, we did the whole in-body test and I want to show you guys my results because obviously I was not prepared for this at all and I kind of been eating like trash, I'm not gonna lie, but um, I'll show you guys. So this is a little in-body test paper at 136.3, I'm not afraid to show you guys, which is really, really good for me. For the longest, my weight goal was 130 to 135, so I'm pretty close to that, guys. I can't believe it. I know I've gotten this requested before, but if you guys want to see um, or kind of want a video of me explaining like my my fitness journey and all of that, let me know because I've definitely done a lot of stuff since moving into my own apartment that I wasn't doing before, of course, and the reason why I wasn't losing weight or maintaining a healthy weight, so yeah. I just realized that I was showing you guys my number there, but yeah, I'm 136.3. I thought I would just show you guys um, because next time I do this, um, I kind of want to compare. So it was really nice that he gave me this, so yeah. I'm at 136. That's really good, actually, for me. I think for the longest, I was stuck at like 139, so I guess I'm like down three pounds from, um, without even actually like keeping track because i feel like yes it's good to weigh yourself on like a weekly basis but i feel like i was kind of not obsessing with like losing weight but i was very much like Ugh, like why why aren't i losing weight you know mm, is that obsessing maybe anyways um i've been drinking well i just started drinking this again i only drink these when i work out by the way or that one time i think for new releases because i had a lot to do um but these are the alani news energy drinks and i have the hawaiian shaped ice one. Oh my god this one is probably my all-time favorite it's so good i had my sister take two of them so she could try them out because she was the one who introduced me to these this one's really good i have like half of it left i usually take half of it like right before my workout and like during my workout i guess and then the other half i'll drink it throughout the day so today i'm not gonna have coffee since i'm already having this but wow i'm very talkative today Okay, I'll see you guys on the next clip because I have to get some work done. Hi guys, so okay, I just parked. Well, actually I've been here for a little bit because I'm trying to find the inspo picture for the nails I want. My hair also looks really messy. Don't don't mind me, okay? Don't mind me right now. I think this is, this might, I'm gonna pop in pictures right here, but I know I have one that I liked of what I wanted exactly. Oh yeah, I do. Okay, yeah, so this, it's kind of what I was going for like this exact thing but this is in pink and what i want would be with the brown stickers which i'll show you the decals right now you guys can see them right here but i'll show you a closer look they're really cute so these are the decals i have they're once again from mmb nails they're super cute and i'm excited to see if brenda can work with these i hope so because they're really cute i'm thinking of doing like once again more of a neutral feel with the baby fat the brown baby fat little decal and the airbrushed hearts super cute i only have one picture because honestly i don't know or maybe even like this i'm not sure which color would go better like just white french tip or like a neutral color we'll see yeah yeah for the most part i think that's what i'm gonna do because i already did burgundy tips although those are cute too but i also I'm gonna show you guys this one but it's not what i'm getting today but i also i'm into the whole like 90s style like nails which i would want to get in the future like these look really really cute too but just to give you guys some ideas of what i kind of like so yeah i'm probably gonna head in already but 
I'll try to show you guys some of the process. We'll see because I don't know if she's ever worked with the decals because they're, um, I think you have to like put them in water in order for them to stick on the nail. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna do all the nails or not. So we'll see, but yeah, it's really gloomy today. Not my favorite. I was thinking of going grocery shopping like right after this, but I think I'm just gonna go home and get some work done because I'm planning on having a release this week and I need to get my ish together. So yes, all right, I'll see you guys. my nails they came out so cute she was able to do the decals for me and I'm so excited they came out super cute like how cute are these nails they came out so good um she was like these are totally you and I honestly think so as well they are very me as you guys know I love the whole Y2K era so yes I'm really happy and they're still pretty fall because of the brown and the like bone color. I don't know. I just really love the nails and I'm really hot. I don't know why. Um, sorry about my hair by the way. But it was really cold in the morning and now it's very sunny. So yeah, I have to drive home now. I think I might stop at my parents because I forgot to take um, my jeans when I came on Sunday. So I might just stop by really quick and then head home because I have some work to do. So, yes, I'll probably see you guys later or tomorrow, not sure, not sure. We'll see. See you guys in the next clip. Hey guys, I'm back with the grocery haul. I went to Sprouts, I actually ended up going kind of like afternoon. And to be quite honest with you guys, I probably will not go to the grocery store at that time ever again because there were so many people. I just haven't gone to the grocery store in like over a week now and I feel like I have nothing to eat. So here I am with the grocery haul. I picked up some things as well as um, my sister told me about the Sprouts app and how you can clip coupons. I went ahead and got a few things discounted as well as for free so let me go ahead and show you guys what i got i'm gonna go ahead and start from this side i ended up getting the dave's killer bread typically i get the smaller version but the last time i made avocado toast i wish that i would have gotten the bigger one so this time around i got the big whole grain and seeds bread and then i got my favorite greek yogurt from the greek gods um, this was actually i think a dollar off on the sprouts app so i got that for a dollar off then i went ahead and picked up two of these chervani coffee creamers so you guys know i picked these up last time and one of you guys actually suggested that i pick up the sweet cream one because that one was your favorite so i went ahead and picked two of these in the sprouts app this was buy one get one free and these were on sale right now actually anyways for 3.79 so so i only ended up paying 3.79 for both of these so that was great up some chicken some ground turkey and turkey bacon i also wanted to go ahead and get some black forest ham i don't know why i've really been wanting to make sandwiches um, and i haven't had a sandwich in a while so i went ahead and picked this up some strawberries as always for my smoothies some eggs i went ahead and picked up two of these alkaline waters these were on sale right now i think for 2.99 so i picked two of these up and this regular one is for my Keurig. I did go ahead and make two trips, by the way. I did not bring all this into my apartment on one trip. So yeah, so I have all the waters here. I also got some milk, some bananas, zucchini, squash, avocados, romaine lettuce, apples. These were on sale two for five dollars i believe they go for like 350 so 250 a piece and if you guys have seen my past two grocery hauls then you guys know i love these i love anything sweet potato so 
I have two bags of these. And then last but not least, I got some jasmine rice. I've actually been out of rice for like two weeks now. And I really didn't want to get any from Sprouts because it's very expensive. And this is not the rice that I use. I mean, I do like to use jasmine rice, but I get like a bigger pack from like Food for Less in the past. I just haven't gone to another grocery store. And so I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna pick up some rice from Sprouts. And so I did. I hope this is good. I'll probably end up making something tonight or tomorrow. But yeah, that's pretty much all of the groceries that I picked up for this and next week. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Mm -hmm.